Facebook friends and Insta followers. I'm standing on Rocky Butte. Behind me is the 205. The goal is to post videos of myself performing 22 push-ups a day for 22 days to promote awareness of veteran suicide prevention along with honoring military service members and veterans. This is day five. Here's some background. In 2013, the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs Mental Health Services Suicide Prevention Program published a suicide data report. This report revealed that there was an estimated 22 veterans who died of suicide. Later that year, the push-up challenge expanded into veteran suicide awareness and became an internet challenge. Today, there are many organizations associated with hashtag 22 kill or hashtag 22 day push-up challenge. I have an immense passion for this cause, which is why I'm aiming for 22 days of nominations. Most people that are nominated won't participate, which is an incredibly strong reminder. Imagine how hard it is for people to ask for help when faced with a mental health crisis. If you're nominated and this isn't your style, maybe resharing this could be the guiding light that helps show someone a way out of the darkness. As I mentioned on day one, I've included a link in this post to an organization that I help called Northwest Battle Buddies. The mission of Northwest Battle Buddies is to empower combat veterans with PTSD by partnering them with professionally trained service dogs. Today, I nominate DeMarcus Sumter. Here's some simple guidelines. Once you're nominated and accept the challenge, your 22 days start the following day. Every day, you record yourself attempting 22 push-ups, even assisted push-ups demonstrate that you care. And every day, you must nominate a different person. Try to choose people that you think would want to do this and have the ability. And finally, have fun with this. This is a simple and engaging way to get the word out about veteran suicide prevention. Enlisting to serve the United States of America is a compassionate and courageous commitment. It's heartbreaking that anyone can believe that suicide was the solution to their situation. It's the wrong decision. Please reach out. You're not alone.